deploy a subgraph on the newly integrated zk sync chain so this time the integration of zk sync era chain is a little different from how we used to do on the graphs hosted service we are going to deploy a subgraph on the graph studio instead so basically the first time you go to the graph.com slash studio and then create a subgraph let's name it zk sync uh demo and we need to select the chain here we'll select zk sync era chain and create a subgraph so this is the interface here all what's required to deploy a subgraph on zk sync era is given in instructions so basically i have to first of all deploy the graph libraries globally and then I need to do graph in it for my first, like what we call as, uh, you know, setup of subgraph. Once that is done, I have a demo subgraph also to show that you can see over here. This is the demo subgraph, which has all the details, like the manifest name, ZK Sing dash era, the smart contract name, the start block, right? Once I have that, I'll go to graph auth here. I'll authenticate my studio subgraph and then I will just do code gen and build. Once that is done, I'll just deploy my CK Sync subgraph on the graph studio. Let's name it 0.0.1. So this subgraph, first of all, you will like, you know, be able to get yourself. This is like what you always have deployed subgraphs on the graph uh, hosted service. Similarly, the subgraph remains the same. Nothing changes over there, right? So all of that remains the same. Just a few commands change. So these are the changes that we have made. And then we have deployed the subgraph and you can see here is the playground. You can play with that subgraph if you want to like check what you requested is correct right and in the details here here is your api key now if i go on any sub uh, uh, like you know net it is not possible to actually sync that particular like it's 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 uh, the api that you get is rate limited but for zk sync era chain uh, on the graph studio there is no rate limiting on this particular api and you can make as many calls as you want to so this is how you deploy a subgraph on zk sync era chain on the graph studio and the api you can use to query uh, will be not rate limited also keep in mind that this particular link is private to you and nobody else can actually you know see it or use this particular api key so if you want to give uh, if you want people to deploy uh, or like you know use these particular apis for their own dashboards you have to share this api key and every time i make an upgrade to my particular uh, subgraph uh, the version over here will be changed so i have to keep that in mind and change that in my front end whenever i update my subgraph thank you